welcome back to shine like a diamond you guys today we are doing whip it wednesday now this is going to be different than what you're probably thinking rather than doing just um, an ordinary whip and chat today we are going to be looking at um, what our diamond painting community is working on this week so i'm going to go through um, about 20 people and what they're working on and then we'll come back and I will reveal to you the two projects that I am working on. So stick around and I will see you in a bit. So the first one we are looking at is being worked on by Misty and it is a 12 by 16 inch seven dollars and one cents and she got it off at aliexpress looks like she's just starting this one you can see on the bottom the little drills that she's starting to place and this one is going to be adorable i love these pastel colors for these birds this next one is worked on by thea i hope i'm saying your name correctly it is a 25 by 50 centimeter um this was a gift uh, to her so she's not sure where they got it or the cost but we do know that it was one of five panels and if you look at the top of the screen you can see what it's going to look like once it's finished and I believe this one is going to be really cool looking this next one is being worked on by Gigi and it is a 50 by 50 centimeters it was $20 and she got it at Hankins off of AliExpress. This picture is 55 years old and she's working on it um, for a gift for her nephew. He loves this picture of his grandparents. Now, if you look up in the top right, you can see the whole picture and what it's going to look like. So this next one is by Kristen. And it is a 36 by 46 centimeters. It was $13.99 and she bought it off of Amazon. Now this cross has 34 different colors in it. And it is absolutely beautiful. I think I've seen a lot of crosses, um, but I really like this one and all these beautiful bright colors. So this next one blows me away. Jennifer is working on this one, and it is Jesus' Last Supper. It is 110 by 350 centimeters. It was $300, and she bought it off of Evermoment off of AliExpress. I mean, this one is huge. You can see the picture in the left popping up. This is how it came in a roll, how thick it is. This is all rolled out. I mean, it is absolutely huge. 11 and a half feet long, you guys. This box right there is showing you all the drills that came with it. And then on the right is where she has worked on it for the last month. Amazing. And she is definitely a brave one for taking on this big of a project. Okay, Beverly is working on this one. It is a 30 by 40 centimeters. It was $12.99 on Amazon. I just really, really love how beautiful her long hair is. I would love if my hair looked like this. And with her holding the cute little tiger, I just love this one. This is so cute. It's going to turn out really, really well when it's done. Okay, so Jilly is working on this next one. It was $10 on Amazon. Um, I'm not sure of the size, but to me it looks like about a 30 by 40 if I was to guess. But I really like how colorful this is, all the purples and the pinks surrounding this beautiful cross. Okay, so this one is being worked on by Nikki. It is 50 by 65 centimeters. She paid $32.07 for it on the Cami Y store on AliExpress. Now, even though it looks like it only has white, black, and yellow, of course it has more. So this one has 33 different colors in it. 
and it is going to be gorgeous. I can't wait to see this one finished. Um, I don't know why I like it so much, but I just love how they have the black, yellow, and white all together. Now, if you look up in the corner, you can see what it's going to look like when it's completed. This one's definitely going to need to be hung on a wall and framed. Okay, so this one has been worked on by Austin. This one is 30 by 40 centimeters. It is $12.99 on Amazon. And this is his second one that he has worked on. And being that it's only his second one, this is his first one that he has worked on that is square. Now, this one, I think he's doing absolutely fantastic. The the drills look like they're really nicely placed together on this one, um, especially for only being your second one ever and doing a square. Way to go, Austin. So this one is being worked on by Jillian. It is 50 by 50 centimeters, and she paid $16.18 for it. Uh, she purchased this off of AliExpress. This one is one of my favorite ones with all the beautiful colors in it. I mean, it is just so, so bright and beautiful. If you look up into the right corner, you can see um, what it's gonna look like when it's finished and it's going to be outstanding. Okay, so this one um, Shauna is working on. It is a 60 by 75 centimeters. It was $25, she purchased it from AliExpress. Um, this one is also square drills. I've been watching her put this one together little by little, and I can tell you, like, this one is going to be amazing. I I don't know. I, I like to call it the sunflower on fire because that's kind of what it looks like to me, but this one is so pretty. I really, really want to do this one. Hopefully, I can um, eventually, but I have a lot in my stock already. But yeah, so Shauna's doing this one, and it is coming together beautifully. Okay, so Victoria is working on this beautiful flag. It is a 60 by 60 centimeters. She paid $17.80 on AliExpress. Um, now, if you look up into your right corner, you can see what it's going to look like when it is finished. And this one is really nice. Um, I want to give a shout out to her, Victoria. She has another YouTube channel um, called Tori's Craft. So if you want to check that out, go ahead and um, look in my description and I will have the link for Tori's Crafts down there. Okay, so this one is being worked on right now by Nicole. Um, and it is Buddha, if you can't tell. And it is 50 by 50 centimeters, and she paid $34 in New Zealand. I don't know what um, the difference in the dollar amount from here to there is. So, yeah, you'll have to figure that out. Um, she got it off of Wish. I have seen this one done by my neighbor, and it is really, really cool once it's all completed. Um, if you look up in the right corner, you can see what that looks like uh, so that you know if you want to do this one or not. Okay, so Jasmine is working on this next one. Um, it says, all you need is love and hot cocoa. It is a 40 by 30. It was $9.66 from the Who Can store. I really want this one, actually. I have one that has coffee on it, and it says something like that. And I have a baking one that says, life is what you bake it. And I think this would go really well with those two. All you need is love and hot cocoa. I mean, come on. What do you need more than that? Okay, so Kim is working on this next one. It is a 40 by 60. She believes she paid $40 for this one. She bought five at a time, um, and they were customs from Joyce on AliExpress. And this one, I believe, is either an engagement picture or an engagement picture that they are using at a wedding, um, something along those sorts. So if this is an engagement or a wedding picture, 
Congratulations to the happy couple. You can see the full picture up in the right hand side and way to go Kim. This is turning out beautiful. Okay, so Samantha is working on this one and it is a mermaid if you cannot tell. It is 50 by 70 centimeters. She paid $21.48, which is a great price, by the way, for that big of a, a canvas. Um, she purchased this off of AliExpress. Now, I love mermaids. I love Ariel. It's always been like my favorite Disney movie. So I really like this one. I want to do it. Um, of course, I'm going to add it to my long list of diamond paintings that I want to do. Um, if you look up in the right hand corner, you can see this one completed the way it's supposed to look at the very end. I think you will agree. It is very, very cool. And it just, it just works as a diamond painting. So Justine is working on this beautiful picture that dates back to the 1940s. This is her grandma, her mom's mom, and she plans on giving this one, once it's completed, to her mother as a gift. And it is turning out wonderfully. It is a 50 by 70 centimeters. She paid $42.95 with a shipping cost of $7.95 added on to that. And she got it from Cato Crafts. Now, if you do look up in the right hand corner, you will see the original picture. Um, again, this picture is back from the 1940s. So this is a picture of a picture that she was able to make into a diamond painting. And I think the detail and quality of this diamond painting turned out wonderfully considering how she got it. Okay, so Barb is working on this one. It is a 35 by 45. She paid $18 for it and she got it off of AliExpress. It is a full round drill. Um, and I would like to point out that pen right there in the middle of the painting is a pen that she got out of my collection. It is a dark blue pen that says, enjoy the moment on it. I just had to point that out real fast. Um, but yeah, if you look up in the right hand corner, you will see this one as it will look when she has completed it. It looks beautiful. I think this one would go really really good like in a kitchen or some kind of a place um where you're going to be serving beverages or something like that because it looks kind of like a little tea time set something back that i don't know something i could see like in my grandma's kitchen or something but wonderful job barb it is looking good so far Okay, and Kim is working on this skull face. Um, it is a 30 by 30. It was $11.99, and she got it off of Amazon. It is on Amazon Prime, so you would get this in, within two days. I like this one. I'm not a particular, like, big skull fan, but I really like this one because of all the pretty colors and the flowers, and it just, it makes it more pretty, I guess you could say. Um, so yeah, I'm excited to see this one finished. Okay, this one is by Kristen K. These are her two dogs. This one is a whopping 90 by 120 centimeters. This one is definitely a big one, but that's great because you're going to be able to see so much detail. You already can see so much detail in the dogs. Um, she bought it from Evermoment off of AliExpress. She paid $96 euros. And again, I don't know the um, conversion of, you know, euros to dollars. So if you want to know what that is, you will have to find that out. My dog is growling in the background. He must have heard me talking about other dogs. Okay. <clears throat> I'm excited to see this one finished. Because, like I said, this one is a nice big size, so you're going to be able to see all the detail in this picture. Okay, so this is the work of Ariel. 
and this is a 40 by 40. She paid $23.64. It is a custom she got from Evermoment um, from AliExpress. I do think I found a kind of theme as I have done this video that a lot of our custom photos are going um, through Evermoment. So if you're looking for a good place, um, they're not sponsoring this video or anything. I'm just saying it out there because I seem to have a theme where there's a lot of Evermoment photos. I have ordered from them. I like them. I haven't heard really anything bad about them. So if you're looking for a good custom, I think they are the way to go, um, especially for a reasonable price. Ariel, I want to know what this is. I don't know if it's some sports theme. Maybe I am just completely in La La Land or something, but I want to see this finished and I want to know what this is. Okay, and this last one is by Erin and it is a 30 by 30. It was approximately five to seven dollars. She got it off a of wish, and they are these beautiful three little dandelions. So this one just goes to show, you can buy one off of wish that's fairly small for a very little amount of money. You can still have fun doing it, and it looks adorable. I love dandelions, and I love how they gave these dandelions more color than your average dandelion that you see in the wild. So. We are now going to go to what I am working on. Okay, it is time to see what I am working on. I, right now, am working on two projects, um, and there's a reason for that. Typically, I have two projects going at one time. I have a square, and I have a round. The reason for that is the square, for me, um, does take a little bit more concentration, a little more um, mental power, if you will. And so when I'm like really tired and I just want to do something just to do it, I work on my round. When I, I really enjoy the square, don't get me wrong, it's just when I'm more, you know, beat, I like working on a round one. Um, but I love the satisfaction of the squares. It like really fills my... OCD need I guess the way they click into place and they match all up really nicely um, and I really like how it covers the whole canvas especially because the round one I'm working on right now I'm having a little bit of a problem with and it's kind of starting to irritate me but I'll get to that in a second so the first one that I am working on that if you have seen my other videos um, you would have seen it already it is Poppy now, this is not her name on the um, the site that she's on, which I got her on Zoom. Or Zoom, I don't know how to pronounce it, so I'm just going with it. But her name on there is just Girl with Butterflies in her hair. And me and my daughter were like, nope, that's not fun. So me, we had a little discussion, and uh, my daughter really liked Poppy. I really liked Poppy. I think it fits her really well. So... We call her Poppy. Um, I'm about halfway done, actually a little more than halfway done, and I love this one. I've had absolutely no problems with it. The drills are nice. I mean, even the 310 blacks are nice. Like, I've had no problems with confetti. I've had no problems with them popping up. Like, it's just, it's been so far a joy to work with. The only reason that I've had to put Poppy aside for just a little bit is because Mother's Day is coming up and I had ordered one off of AliExpress that I'm doing for my grandma. Now, this one I could only find in a round, so that's what I got it in. Let me just put Poppy aside there. Okay, so I'm working on this one right now for my grandma. This is, um, it is an old fashioned uh, sewing machine and I could probably pull this down a little bit and you can kind of see if you haven't seen this one already. I'll show you a picture afterwards too of both of the ones I'm working on the, the finished products. Um, but so it just is, um, if you can see, so there's the quilt hanging in the background, which coincidentally enough, my grandma has a quilt hanging on her wall and it's hung the exact same way this one is. Um, and then this is this old fashioned quilt that, um, or old fashioned sewing machine, I'm sorry, that my papa, who passed away about a year and a half ago, um, had restored 
one for each of us girls. And it is like identical to the one that she has right now sitting out in her sunroom. So I saw this one and I was like, I have to have it for her. So I ordered this one, so I'm working on this one. I've gotta get it done by Mother's Day because I wanna get it framed um, so that I can give it to her by that day. Mother's Day is May 12th, in case you didn't know. So this is the one I have been drilling away on, um, trying to get this one done so that I can get that one um, framed and so I can really get back to Poppy because I was really enjoying working on Poppy. Um, so those are the ones I'm working on right now. However, the small problem that I'm having with this one, which I don't normally order from Who Can, they've had problems in the past. I heard that they had fixed a lot of their problems. So I decided, what the heck, I'll try it, we'll see. Um, because this one was only $12.81, not that much. And it's a 40 by 40, has, um, I don't even know how many colors. Let me look here. 35 colors. It's the drills, you know, have been nice to work with. However, a problem I am having, and I don't know if you can see, I'm going to try to get real close. So if you can see for every drill, there's a circle rather than just the color behind it. So because of that, and it being a black circle, and some of these are white drills, you can see the circle if it's not perfectly placed. I mean like adequately right on the spot. And so I have had to spend much more time trying to put these, you know, and move them a little bit so that you don't see that black circle. It drives me crazy to see any of the background that's not the color of the drill. So that bugs me. That's one of the reasons I do like squares, but I've had a lot of success with round ones that um, I haven't had this problem very often and I'm not a big fan of who can so but that's okay I'm gonna finish it I'm gonna get it done power through and make it work so sorry about my nails I had them done today and then I was gonna redo them didn't have time to do them for this project because I had to get this done today for you guys for whip it Wednesday so I know this is a little bit different than um, what you're used to for whip it Wednesdays but that's what we're doing here. So if your um, project was not featured in today's uh, video and you want it to be featured in next week's video, give me a message either on here um, in the comments or on my uh, Facebook group. I will link that below in the description and I will feature it next week. If you had messaged me um, this week and it did not get in for some reason, I will message you why it could be that the picture didn't show enough of the project. So I wasn't sure what we were looking at, um, or I didn't have enough information for you from you. So, um, hopefully that next week we will get all of you guys in that want to be in and I look forward to seeing you next time. Thanks for coming by. Bye guys. And don't forget to keep on shining.